What's up, family? This is your man, not your boy. Go black to Africa. So I wanted to go ahead and show you all a nice place to stay in Sierra Leone. You know, Sierra Leone uh, has different places you can stay, mostly hotels. Uh, you can do Airbnbs. Uh, I find, me personally, that there are some that are just not up to my standard. But even a place I stayed in a hotel, uh, let's just say, just keep it lightly or politely, it was uh, not a good experience. Especially when you're paying for one person to stay in a room and you got other guests like roaches. And this place was high on a uh, review. This place right here where I'm staying is a place where you have dignitaries and you have uh, each one of these are more or less like condos or what have you with different apartment units and stuff. Um, 65 bucks a night. I'll show y'all my room, but I want to give y'all just a taste. If you come to Sierra Leone, come check out this villa right here. Um, it's a nice place, you know, and uh, I'll show you inside of mine. But uh, save yourself the money, the hassle, because uh, I wasn't very much happy staying four days in a place that uh, I had others in my room who weren't paying the rent. So... I'm going to continue on and show you more. But this right here is a place that, like I said, where dignitaries and even the embassy, Turkish embassy is in here, as you see the embassy flag that's right there uh, that you can see. So I don't even know if I can videotape or not. But anyway, I'm giving you all that right there, family. And it even goes around. It's an L shape. It goes around down here, many of the units. So this right here is my unit right here. You say that these are like big houses with six bedrooms. So we walk right into the front door. Locked, secured. Got a little dining area right here or eating area if you want to. Come down to eat. Sitting area. Upstairs, second floor. Down here, you got your kitchen you can use. I didn't mention there was a washing machine right out with the front door right before we came in. So you got a kitchen at your disposal. Got a bedroom here. Common area bathroom. We're gonna walk upstairs. Third floor up there with a couple of rooms that they rent out. Another sitting area, no furniture here though. Out here you have the balcony you can come out on. And here you got a couple of bedrooms. A couple of bedrooms, a common area bathroom. Yeah. All right, here is the entering into the room. Got your small fridge. You have TV. Of course, you got a desk, a working desk. And you got your bed. Air conditioning unit. Got your and then you have your bathroom with your shower. So that's it, $65 a night. And use your house, kitchen, wash machine downstairs. That is it, fam. So family, let me add a few things here. Uh, when it comes here to Sierra Leone that I find quite interesting. They have places that you can rent. There's some decent places, I guess. I haven't been to all the places. 
Um, the odd thing is that very few are on the side where the airport is. And there are more over on the Freetown and it becomes very limited as you get further away from the city. Um, so you have to really do your research and you have to look where you uh, want to stay. And um, as far as the cost is concerned, they may vary. And uh, the accommodations you may be used to may, may be there, may not be there. This particular place here, like I said, um, it is right here in the Aberdeen area or near Lumley Beach, if you will. And so it's on the same strip. Um, and as I was looking, it was really hard to find some places that I thought uh, were either conducive to what I'm used to or price range, um, the location, you know, the area. And so you got to do your homework on this right here. Typically, you know, you might find places that have a lot more options um, in selections that you are probably used to staying or um, having those uh, familiar places, you know. Uh, you have to look on Airbnbs and you can look up hotels and, you know, you can find them all on the, um, you know, booking.coms and, you know, tripadvisor.coms. You can go in there and find all that. So, yeah, but I'm happy with this place right here. Um, for the price, 65 bucks, it's 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 really the lower end of price that you'll find. But there again, it's a place where you're going to find Dignitary Stand. And it's a, it's a decent place. It's got the security around. It has, you know, a washing machine and all the other things that if you need to cook, use a microwave and, you know, refrigerators in your room, air conditioning. It's got everything. So it, to me, it's well worth the price. With that family, this is your man, not your boy. Go black to Africa. <laughs>